Christy here with my October Daily Album cover. I was so excited when I got home today and I had my package from scrapbook.com with the last of my um, October Daily goodies. So when I decided to do October Daily, I ordered this uh, yellow Snap album because I wanted all my albums to be like different colors so I had already I already have a black mini album and a red mini album and a turquoise mini album and so I decided that the yellow would be uh, the way to go and the after dark collection has a bit of yellow in it so uh, I decided to go with this 12 by 12 paper um, uh, which has a ton of yellow in it and so I just trimmed it down I tried to trim it down so that you could still see some of the words like spook treat and boo uh, so that's what you saw me doing there in the beginning but because I do add a bunch of embellishments you don't end up seeing a ton of the words but it still brings in the colors and I still really do like the way it it turns out um, I got a whack of sticky thumb uh, adhesives in an Instagram giveaway, so here I am. I'm just using those for the first time, and I really do like this double-sided tape. Uh, it's super sticky, and it was perfect for adhering down this paper to the chipboard part um, of the album. And I did ink the edges just to kind of bring in a little bit more black and uh, just to add some more interest as well. So I bought these this wire ribbon uh, from Michaels a few weeks ago. It was in the clearance section and each roll was a dollar. So I couldn't pass that up. And I bought it with the intention of using it on the album. So here I am just wrapping it around two times and I don't end up liking the way it looks so I just kind of let it sit for a while and I come back to it a little bit later. This wood veneer piece is also from Michaels. I bought it in like a six pack or something and um, I knew I wanted to use that uh, thicker uh, gold thicker gold glitter thicker that said October because it's massive and I knew I wouldn't be able to really use it anywhere else so I knew I wanted to use it on my album cover and I'm just the gold glitter and the wood veneer didn't offer enough contrast so I ink uh, the wood veneer black and then just let it dry uh, I make sure to wash my hands in between <laughs> because I'm notorious for messing things up and getting ink all over the place. So off camera, I took, well, I took off the ribbon and off camera, I just twisted the two pieces um, kind of into each other uh, so that it was like more connected and not uh, like not any gaps in between like before. And so I twisted the two pieces and then wrapped them around twice and then just tucked the tails in because it is a wire ribbon it is stuck stuck on there pretty well then that little label you see is from studio calico the color theory line and i thought initially that i would use it to put the gear on but i decide not to use it and so I used those black thickers from the After Dark collection to spell out the word daily. I really like that font. Um, I give the wood veneer another coat of ink and just let it dry for a few minutes. And then I'm ready to add this um, October thicker. And the wood veneer has like a little hole on it. I'm not sure if the wood veneers were initially used, intended for uh, like a banner or for hanging. But I knew I wanted to cover the hole, so that's what you see me checking uh, just then. And I adhere it down with some glossy accents. And I really love the contrast between the paper and the black web. I think it just looks really cool. So here I am, I'm adding the thickers, and um, off camera, after I complete the album, I do end up shifting down the word October, uh, so it's sitting like directly on top of the word daily. I just feel like where it is right now, it's kind of disconnected uh, from 
um, the other part of the title. I pull out some foam tape, like that's so sticky. Uh, I think I just got this from the dollar store. I haven't really used foam tape before, like a ton, so it was kind of a bit of a learning, <laughs> learning curve, and uh, I edited a lot of it out. So I just used some foam tape to uh, pop up that the letter O because it's sitting on the album and not on the wood veneer like most of the other letters are. And then I just have to add a little bit more foam tape to the letter R. So that's what you see me doing now. And I really love the way that that uh, turns out. Um, I just had to tuck in some of the foam tape because uh, a lot of it was kind of poking out and I really did not like the way it looked. So I wanted to bring in some embellishments and some ephemera. So I went to the After Dark collection because I was looking for a spider and I could not believe that there wasn't a single spider in the whole collection. So luckily I had this uh, little tag from Michaels. I just trimmed off the the whole part of the tag to make it uh, more web shape shaped and added the spider there with some more foam tape and I really like the pop of orange um, yeah so then these enamel dots and gems are from Michaels as well and I'm using the silver and orange gems on my cover and I'm just kind of like sprinkling them all over the place um, I haven't really used a lot of gems in my project life before, so that was pretty fun. And then the ephemera pack had these little labels and paper clips, so I decided to put the year on, um, uh, on one of the labels. And I decided to do so with these Studio Calico, um, numerical, uh, wood veneer pieces. And then this little medallion piece is from Recollections, and I just wanted to add a little bit more interest to the top left-hand corner. I tried to use this uh, sticky thumb adhesive, but it just wasn't working, and I ended up breaking one of my um, numbers, so I decided just to go with my glossy accents. I couldn't get the adhesive to um, start pumping out so like I it says to uh, press down a couple times well I pressed down like probably a hundred times and nothing was coming out so uh, yeah so I just went with the glossy accents use some of the sticky thumb tape to adhere down the label and to hold down that uh, paper clip and just put that there under the spider add a few more gems. Uh, I decided just to add all the gems <laughs> and use up uh, the last few that I had uh, in the row. And I just see if my album will actually stand up and it does. <laughs> Thank goodness. But yeah, I'm really happy with how it looks. I do, like I said, shift down the word October and you will see that in the still shots. Thank you so much for watching. Please stay tuned for more October Daily uh, to come in the next few days. Thanks so much. Bye.